He said, quote, I, Donald J. Trump, are calling for a complete and total shutdown of all Muslim immigration to the United States. The parallels between the travel ban case and the Korematsu and Haribiyashi cases have been the subject of a lot of discussion. And the parallels are many. They start with the day that this whole thing began, December 7th, 2015, when Donald Trump called for a, quote, complete and total shutdown of all Muslim immigration to the United States, end quote. That's a quote from our president. That's kind of like the quotes that FDR's folks said about the Japanese American internments, isolating people not on an individual basis, but on a, some sort of group characteristic. You don't have to treat people as a group, Japanese Americans. And the same thing is true in the travel ban. Congress has actually looked at all of this evidence that Trump points to, this evidence that there are people from these countries that are dangerous. And what Congress has said is, yeah, absolutely. We're going to force those people to have, go through security, go through visa screening, all sorts of things on an individual basis. And yet, the president still forges ahead with his blanket national security, in quotes, order to ban travel from these countries. And what that really does is it replicates the same debate we had before in World War II. And it is very suggestive of the fact that it's not probably national security that's going on here. I do worry about the amnesia around this issue. This stuff can happen again. We don't want to talk about the Native Americans and what we did. We don't want to talk about slavery, and we certainly don't want to talk about the Japanese American internment. But if we don't talk about it, we don't grow, we don't learn, and it can happen again.